Hello ladies and welcome back or if you're new here welcome hello my name is Samantha and it is great to have you I upload new videos every single Sunday so if you are not yet subscribed hit that button down below and join us here on my channel as I'm sure you can tell from the title of this video, today I'll be sharing my recent purchases from Black Friday with you all. I initially only planned on including Aritzia in this, however their sale was a little bit disappointing, so I went to the next best place and that is Club Monaco. Club Monaco is another store that I absolutely adore, I love their basics, everything is such good quality. I haven't shopped there in a while, so this was the perfect opportunity to re-familiarize myself with their pieces and their aesthetic. And let me tell you, I was not disappointed in the slightest. So if you'd like to see my purchases from both Aritzia and Club Monaco, make sure you stay till the very end. Before we dive into the pieces, I did want to give you all a little bit of information on the brands and the sales that they are holding. So Aritzia has 50% off select items, and I believe that sale will be on till the end of this week. However, if that is wrong, feel free to correct me in the comments down below. Club Monaco, on the other hand, is having 30% off everything. So online, in stores, jewelry, their candles and accessories, everything is 30% off. I don't know when that one started, nor do I know when it goes till. It just says that it's a limited time offer. So you might be able to find a bit more information on that. However, just from those facts alone, I was surely more excited about the sale at Club Monaco. So since I was most excited about Club Monaco sale, let's start there. So the first item and the one I was most excited about is this extremely oversized, very long, sweater dress. We've got some ballooning arms, which I personally love. The sleeves are very long, which is good for those of us who have long arms. And it is a turtleneck with an adjustable zipper. So you get to decide just how much neck you are serving on a particular day. So as you can see, you can open it up quite wide. I do like the fact that it is an adjustable neck because if you're going out for lunch during the day and it's a little bit warmer, this is a great option to wear and you can have your zipper undone. But you do also have the comfort of knowing that if it gets a bit chillier, that you can just zip yourself up and you're good to go. I love this sweater paired with some thigh high boots and a crossbody. Because of how bulky the sweater itself is, you can throw on a belt to cinch in the waist or just use the crossbody to do that as I have. I think that this is a gorgeous sweater and I know I'm going to get plenty of wear out of it. But with that being said, I think I did make the mistake of buying a large when I should have bought a medium. I would love to know if you all agree or if you think the large fits me perfectly as is. Next we have a dress that I loved so much I had to buy it twice in two different colors. So the first one is this black and white textured print with a scoop neck and a invisible zipper in the back, which I love. We don't need zippers distracting from our outfits. So these sleeves, very cute, the perfect length. The dress itself is also the perfect length. It hits me just above my knee, which I think is perfect for being sexy yet classy. This dress is slightly fitted, so it will give you a bit of a shape if you do not have one, like me. So I love that. And if you want to take it one step further, you can add on a nice belt to cinch your figure in even more. I chose to pair this dress with my suede over the knee boots from Saint Laurent, as well as my suede crossbody from Saint Laurent. I did this because I wanted to integrate another texture into the outfit and I wanted to bring in black as well as gold to match my belt. So all in all, I think that this outfit is very cute, it's very versatile, you could easily wear this for a nice dinner or for brunch or simply running errands if you want to look super cute. Next we have the same dress but in grey. 
This one is a bit more cool toned than I'm personally used to, so buying this was a little bit outside of my comfort zone. However, I really liked how it looked, so I went for it and I was not disappointed. The fit, again, is perfect. As I said with the last one, it's such a flattering cut. And this is a dress in a color that I think would be good for more casual wear. So the black I would wear for evenings out, as I mentioned. However, I do think that the gray is a perfect casual option when paired with some sneakers and a nice jacket. So in my case, I decided to use my Chanel sneakers and my camel coat. Now we are on to this dress that I am currently wearing. This is the start of my Aritzia purchases. And believe it or not, this is the only item that I purchased from Aritzia that was actually on sale. With that being said, this dress is a piece that I have had my eyes on over the last few months, so I was very happy to see that it went on sale. This is a gorgeous, flowy, classy, yet sexy gallery dress, as it is called by Aritzia. This is exactly what I would wear if I was going to an art showing. I think it is so stunning, and I especially love the mother of pearl details on the buttons. And that is exactly why I decided to wear a pearl necklace. It brings the outfit together, it's a beautiful detail, and I think the necklace itself is also pretty cute. This is from Club Monaco, however, and yes, it was on sale for those of you who may be curious. Continuing on with Aritzia, we have this super oversized cable knit turtleneck sweater dress. As you can probably tell, sweater dresses are slowly becoming my thing. They're just so chic and most importantly, very comfortable. If you want a cute outfit and you're short on time, simply throw on a sweater dress, a pair of over the knee boots, and a cute coat, and you're set. And believe it or not, we have a third turtleneck dress. This one is ultra long, so I'm not going to be able to show it to you on camera, but in the try on, you'll see that this is so chic. It is such a soft material, and the fit of it is very flattering. I have nothing bad to say about this dress. Honestly, I would love it in every single color. The neckline is perfect, the sleeves are so cozy, and again, the perfect length. There is a sexy split on the leg, which if you know me, you know I love, but it's not over the top and you don't risk showing anything that you don't want to show. So I am very pleased with this dress. Also, because I knew I was going to be doing this video and picking up a little haul for myself, I took the liberty to clean out my closet the other day, which was such a freeing experience. And I vlogged it. So next week's video is going to be a mini wardrobe makeover, which I'm sure plenty of you are very excited to see because I cannot count the amount of questions I've got requesting to show my closet. So make sure you're subscribed because you will not want to miss that video. With that being said, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. I appreciate you and I'll see you in the next one.